Uh, last thing, how how is being friends with Nick Wright? Is is he somebody that you're? Have you ever won an argument or a debate with Nick? I would say so. Would he? He would. <laughs> he would. He would say no. Uh, but no, Nick is the uh, Nick's the man. Um, going to Kansas City this weekend for his vow renewal slash wedding ceremony that him and his beautiful wife never uh, gave themselves. I will be the best man in that wedding. Nick is. Uh, Nick is an incredible, an incredible human being. For as talented as he is, for as smart as he is, he's an even better dude. Um, and I'm thrilled for the success of First Things First. The, he, he is on a hit TV show with ratings that are just growing and growing and growing. Um, he, is, he is a star, and I would just say to people that they haven't seen anything yet. Um, that guy is going to have a monster career. And he already does, but uh, it's going to... Whatever you think of, of, you know, Keith Olbermann, Bomani Jones, Scott Van Pelt, Bob Costas, like that, that's the level of intellect and talent that we're talking about here. How was getting to, to do uh, First Things First last month? That was awesome. Yeah, that was crazy. Uh, was in town for the Barrett Sports Media Conference. And the day before we were leaving, Nick texted uh, Pony and me, Andrew Filipponi, and said, bring an extra suit. Uh, Broussard was on vacation. And I guess Greg Jennings and Eric Mangini, their New York-based football analysts, weren't available. And obviously the Bears are the story of the offseason. And then uh, Russell Wilson in Pittsburgh. And then they trade Kenny Pickett like 10 minutes before we go on the air. So it was also topical. And so, yeah, got to do uh, got to do some national television. Is that something – like were, were you nervous for that at all? Just being yeah. Ha- yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, I mean, a little get, bit. Still, like, right. Still get still get nervous for things like that. Yeah. Good. Good nerves, though. Yeah. Of you course. know what I mean? Like, it's it, it, I feel I think if you don't get I, I don't I don't get nerves going on the radio today, at two. Right. But you get a little bit of nerves when you're doing something different, something and big and, and that sort of thing. Like uh, not enough that it was debilitating or anything. But, yeah, sure. I was I was pacing around a little bit before we walked in, of course. 